If so-called rabbis, which Christ said to be not called, were Abraham's children, they would do the works of Abraham, right? Romans 4, 12 to 14. And the father of circumcision to them who are not of the circumcision only, but who also walk in the steps of that faith of our father Abraham, which he had being yet uncircumcised. For the promise that he should be the heir of the world was not to Abraham or to his seed through the law, but through the righteousness of faith. For if they which are of the law be heirs, faith is made void and the promise made of none effect. Romans 4.3 for what saith the scripture, Abraham believed God, and it was counted unto him for righteousness. Acts 7, 8. And he gave him the covenant of circumcision. And so Abraham begat Isaac, and circumcised him the eighth day. And Isaac begat Jacob, and Jacob begat the twelve patriarchs. Genesis 17, verses 9 to 14. And God said unto Abraham, Thou shalt keep my covenant, therefore thou and thy seed after thee in their generations. This is my covenant, which ye shall keep between me and you and thy seed after thee. Every man-child among you shall be circumcised, and ye shall circumcise the flesh of your foreskin. And it shall be a token of the covenant betwixt me and you. And he that is eight days old shall be circumcised among you, every man-child in your generations. He that is born in the house, or bought with money of any stranger, which is not of thy seed, he that is born in thy house, and he that is bought with thy money, must needs be circumcised, and my covenant shall be in your flesh for an everlasting covenant. And the uncircumcised man-child, whose flesh of his foreskin is not circumcised, that soul shall be cut off from his people. He hath broken my covenant. Jeremiah 4, verses 4 to 7. Circumcise yourselves to the Lord, and take away the foreskins of your heart, ye men of Judah and inhabitants of Jerusalem, lest my fury come forth like fire and burn that none can quench it. Because of the evil of your doings, declare ye in Judah and publish in Jerusalem and say, Blow ye the trumpet in the land, cry, gather together and say, Assemble yourselves and let us go into the defensed cities. Set up the standard toward Zion. Retire, stay not, for I will bring evil from the north and a great destruction. The lion is come up from his thicket, and the destroyer of the Gentiles is on his way. He has gone forth from his place to make thy land desolate, and thy cities shall be laid waste without an inhabitant. Philippians 3, verses 2 and 3. Beware of dogs, beware of evil workers, beware of the concision. For we are the circumcision, which worship God in the Spirit, and rejoice in Christ Jesus, and have no confidence in the flesh. The word concision is related to mutilation, by the way. Ephesians 2, 11 and 12. Wherefore remember that ye being in time past Gentiles in the flesh, who are called uncircumcision, by that which is called the circumcision in the flesh made by hands, that at that time ye were without Christ, being aliens from the commonwealth of Israel and strangers from the covenants of promise, having no hope and without God in the world. Romans 9, verses 6 to 8. Not as though the word of God hath taken none effect, for they are not all Israel, which are of Israel. Neither, because they are the seed of Abraham, are they all children. But in Isaac shall thy seed be called, that is, they which are the children of the flesh. These are not the children of God, but the children of the promise are counted for the seed. Romans 2, 28 and 29. For he is not a Jew, which is one outwardly. Neither is that circumcision, which is outward in the flesh. But he is a Jew, which is one inwardly, and circumcision is that of the heart. In the spirit, and not in the letter, whose praise is not of men, but of God.
Acts 2.39, For the promise is unto you and to your children, and to all that are afar off, even as many as the Lord our God shall call. Galatians 3.14, That the blessing of Abraham might come on the Gentiles through Jesus Christ, that we might receive the promise of the Spirit through faith. Hebrews 10.35 and 36, Cast not away therefore your confidence, which hath great recompense of reward. For ye have need of patience, that after ye have done the will of God, ye might receive the promise. Hebrews 2, verses 14 to 16, For as much then as the children are partakers of flesh and blood, he also himself likewise took part of the same, that through death he might destroy him that had power over death, that is, the devil, and deliver them who through fear of death were all their lifetime subject to bondage. For verily he took not in, on him the nature of angels, but he took on him the seed of Abraham. Jeremiah 11, 9 and 10. And the Lord said unto me, A conspiracy is found among the men of Judah and among the inhabitants of Jerusalem. They are turned back to the iniquities of their forefathers, which refused to hear my words, and they went after other gods to serve them. The house of Israel and the house of Judah hath broken my covenant, which I have made with their fathers. Isaiah 45, 7, I form the light and create the darkness. I make peace and create evil. I, the Lord, do all these things. Jeremiah 11, verses 11 to 14, Therefore, thus saith the Lord, Behold, I will bring evil upon them, which they shall not be able to escape. And though they shall cry unto me, I will not hearken unto them. Then shall the cities of Judah and inhabitants of Jerusalem go and cry unto the gods unto whom they offer incense, but they shall not save them at all in the time of their trouble. For according to the number of thy cities were thy gods, O Judah, and according to the number of thy streets, of the streets of Jerusalem, have ye set up altars to that shameful thing, even altars to burn incense unto Baal. Therefore pray not for this people." Neither lift up a cry or prayer for them, for I will not hear them in the time that they cry unto me for their trouble. In an article from what's called the Jewish Press, dated April 14, 2013, a fellow who goes by Rabbi... Mosh Morisano, director of the Division for Circumcisions in the Israeli Chief Rabbinate, emphasized in his letter that the ritual of oral suction should not be carried out when the mole is ill or has a sore in his mouth. And I'll leave a link for that article under this video. You see, the homosexual pedophile vampires recently had some liability issues that had to do with the death of some children who contracted herpes through this and others who suffered brain damage over this act of theirs. Revelation 3, verses 6 to 10. He that hath an ear, let him hear what the Spirit saith unto the churches. And to the angel of the church in Philadelphia write, These things saith he that is holy, he that is true, he that hath the key of David, he that openeth and no man shutteth, and shutteth and no man openeth. I know thy works. Behold, I have set before thee an open door, and no man can shut it. For thou hast a little strength, and hast kept my word, and hast not denied my name. Behold, I will make them of the synagogue of Satan, which say they are Jews, and are not, but do lie. Behold, I will make them to come, and worship before thy feet, and to know that I have loved thee. Because thou hast kept the word of my patience, I also will keep thee from the hour of temptation, which shall come upon all the world to try them that dwell upon the earth.' 